So hello and welcome to my first patron only video in ages. Um, unfortunately it's not DIY, it's just a little catch up um, and I just want to say thank you to everyone who supports my channel and apologies for not having as many patron only videos on as I would like, I will be doing more of that. So in replace of the recent videos that I haven't been able to get on, um, the extra videos on, on Patreon, um, especially for my $20 and more tier um, patrons, I will be popping an extra little something in the post for you in the next couple of days along with your monthly gift. Um, so what I want to post you is everything you need to make the little paper sailboat that I made a couple of weeks ago. She's always there, she's always lying either here or here. Okay, so the little paper sailboat that I made which is there, just working on some new sketches over there which I haven't really got to show you yet. So to make this little paper sailboat, what I've done is I've printed out two templates. So there's the template for the sail, so you would just cut that out, and the template for the boat, so you would just cut that out. Um, so you'd cut that out and then you would draw around it onto the card. So I, I haven't been able to use the same card for everybody because I just didn't have enough. But um, I've made sure it's all kind of similar looking. So there's a square piece you'll get, a square piece of card for the sale, um, and it's double sided. So you could use the different side if you want, and you'll get this bigger piece of card to draw around the actual boat on. And then you would cut out the boat out of here, and then you would just obviously make sure you cut in to these sections here, um, going all the way around. And then the dotted line area obviously is where you would fold up the sides of the boat, and then you would stick the inside together in here. So you watched my video off two weeks ago if you want to um, just refresh your memory. So that's what you would do with the boat. And then the next bit really to do is to put the little mass support in here. That's what I've called it anyway. So I've made a lot of these. i put a hole in. So you would just line it up with the width of the boat and you would bend down the two sides and then just sellotape them into the inside there. Um, and then you would pop your little um, mast in. Um, or you could decorate it first, but just make sure that obviously the decoration's not in the way for pushing it in. So I've got some ribbon there for you to do that with. And then the string to hold this, um, to hold these two areas together. So this is one piece of string here, so you'll be getting a piece of that. And then a shorter piece of string to hold the sail to the front. Now what you'll have to do is just make a couple of little holes in the front of the boat. So you could either use carefully use a hole punch if you can get the angle right, um, or a pair of scissors and a hole in the front there as well. And then you'll have to make two more holes for the back here to tie the string on. Now I couldn't possibly find the time to make all the little flags for everybody, so what I have done is I've made everybody a little template of the flags. So then you would just draw around this onto whatever spare paper you've got, and then you just fold it over. Like obviously over the string and then you just glue it on any glue fit stick would do any glue just to glue that on there and then you could put one on the top if you want have I missed anything out oh this is just the I was going to put the little bits just in like a little this little sealed bag so that's just a little like piece of rope that I, I made just to pop in the inside of the boat um, have I missed anything out no I'll be posting these literally if not today tomorrow for definite sorry my phone keeps pinging um, I have a load of other things I've been making for people um, and obviously I'm going to be posting out um, your free gift that you'll be getting anyway. So I've made these little cards. These took, took quite a while to make, although I did actually manage to use quite a lot of the leftover bits off um, when I made the tags. So when I cut these sections off to, to shape the tags, then I ended up being able to use those little bits there for that um, so yeah that's been quite um, quite it's taken quite a while but I don't mind like, like I say I appreciate all the help that you gave us that you give us and you know everybody that's just joined thank you and welcome and everybody that's stuck with us when I've really struggled to get videos on so like I say um, I'm going to be making you a set of this uh, a boat set to put together It'd be great if you can take a photo and send it to us either email or I don't know if you can just put it on the Patreon page I'm not quite sure if you can post a picture on there but it'd be great to see your little your little boats and hopefully I've done everything right I have actually included a set of instructions I don't know how good this is gonna 
going to be. This took me ages last night. I just couldn't get things lined up. And um, it's probably, I'm not the best writer, but um, it does stay on the bottom. Watch the video if you get stuck. So I'm going to be doing that for you. And um, yeah, these will be getting sent off hopefully today or tomorrow at the latest, as well as the patron boxes. And like I say, you'll be getting two gifts. And these little paper boats, it's just an extra thing I'm sending to quite a few of you for the support you've gave me. And in particular, people who support me on the $20 and above. Um... Oh, are you awake? Are you awake, Minnie? Are you awake? Some of the people that support me um, on the tier, which should include more videos, um, paper only videos, which I haven't been able to get really get done. So this is, I know this is not a DIY as such, but I thought I would pop this on as a little update. So I'll be giving, I'll be sending in this little um, DIY boat kit, um, kind of in replace of the last few videos that I didn't manage have managed to get on, as well as your little monthly gift as well. So, Nani, do you want a treat? I know people have been saying, let me just go and get a treat, sorry, it's a little bit messy. Um, I know people have been saying that the dog doesn't seem very, um, me man bodies, but the dog doesn't seem very um, happy. But I can assure you she's absolutely fine. She's just, a new little girl, eh? She's absolutely fine. Come in here where it's nice and sunny. And um, she's, yeah, she just she lies around. But, um... <laughs> Not when there's food about. Oh, look. Like, let me see if you can remember the tricks. Let me see. We've not really done this much. Yeah, you know where they are, don't you? Okay. Right. First of all, what... First, wait. Wait. What are you going to do for a treat? Ah, oh, Minnie. Minnie, that was good. And then you lay down. That was meant to just be a twirl. <laughs> right, come on. On your feet. On your feet. On your feet. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. Right, wait. I'm going to put the treat. I'm going to put the treat on my leg. She'll still do the things. Wait. Okay, left paw. Good girl. Right paw. Wait. Up, up, up. High five. Good girl. Now, one spin. One spin. Sit. Wait. Minnie. Concentrate. Lie down. No, no, lie down. Good girl. We'll have to start doing roll over. Right, these are only really small. Oh, these are only really small. Oh, another one. Yeah, this is a good girl. I'm sure there was three. So this is one of the dog's favourite spots here, just at my window. Excuse it needs a bit of a clean because she's always at this window. And then she can kind of see what's going on a little bit outside on the street there. My daughter's just left all of our artwork there under the table. So yeah, she likes it there. And we can open this window and she just she just looks out. Don't you? Don't you like that window? Oh you see I said the word window and I was just going to see. Don't you go and look don't you don't you look out the window and wait for people? Hey? Haha. <laughs> She's so cute. Thank you for watching. Have a lovely um, weekend coming and from me and Minnie, bye for now.